has been extremely positive from what we've heard. Like yeah. the pain, the pain that you were feeling before surgery, you're not feeling those things. Even though you're not running and cutting yet, but just the walking and moving around every day, you're not feeling that pain. Yeah, definitely doing much better. I mean, rehab, it's been a long process, obviously, way longer than I'd like it to be, but um, it's definitely cut out in stages, and I keep, you know, checking off the marks I'm supposed to. I'm getting better each week. So that's Alonzo Ball, ZO2, the Chino Hills prodigy was on NBC Sports Chicago during the second quarter talking to Stacey King and company against the Sacramento Kings. It was Bulls Kings today, and Lonzo laid down a lot. Uh, he was on there for about a good portion of that second quarter. It, this is a beautiful sight to see Lonzo in Chicago mingling amongst the squad. I think this is what's needed. A lot of people forget that Lonzo Ball actually is a member of the Chicago Bulls. A lot of people try to separate Lonzo and the Bulls and things like that. Um, and we everybody got to must understand this is his basketball team at the end of the day. He's a member of the Bulls. And it's good to see him as a starting point guard. We all know what he did when he was in that seat, you know, catapulting the Bulls to that rightful position. It's evident that he is the piece that brings them to the promised land. And we got a lot of things to discuss. Lonzo Ball stated that he is closer, close to running and cutting. Also, Lonzo Ball stated that he is checking off all of the boxes, how his rehab process has been excellent. He hasn't had any setbacks, you know, uh, so everything is on track. Billy Donovan is pleased, the training staff is pleased, the Bulls are pleased, that now everybody is, up and all and excited um, for Lonzo's progress because they know what this means. Lonzo's coming back to the court. Now, people could sit up there and say this and that, how he's going to look. That's that's neither here nor there. Lonzo Ball wants to play basketball at the end of the day. Let him go out there and play. Listen, this is we're we in a new era, ladies and gentlemen. We have the best doctors, the best medicine, you know, things of that nature. Lonzo has had a, a, an ex and he said during this uh, interview that this rehab process has been a lot longer than he would have liked. So I'm telling you, Lonzo has rehabbed that knee a lot. I don't a, a lot of people expect Lonzo not to be out now. Is he going to be? guns blazing, doing everything he was doing when he, maybe not right away, but I'm not expecting Lonzo to take this drastic approach. Lonzo wasn't always, obviously he's athletic, but he didn't always uh, show off too much athleticism. What Lonzo was doing for the Bulls in terms of playmaking, none of that's going nowhere. You know, the IQ, that's that's not going. Lonzo could, could walk around and, 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 and damn near, um, play make better than half the league. You understand? And I'm talking about walking around, literally. You understand? So none of that's going nowhere. The three ball ability that he basically, you know, perfected with Vincent, you know, they spoke on that as well. Stacey King brought that up. You know, Fred Vincent took his three point shot to the next level. We all know that. None of that's going nowhere. You understand? Um, and like, listen, I think Lonzo Ball is going to be, he's is the quintessential player in this league in terms of the way he was excelling for the Bulls. He was, unfortunately, a lot of people got upset, but in that three and D role, you know, but facilitating when they allowed him. Now, I expect if he was to come back, they to just give him the reins, say, please help us, Lonzo. Now, they are dealing with a serious situation right now with Zach Levine. Lonzo spoke on that with Zach. He spoke on the character, the man of Zach Levine. You understand? He said how Zach Levine, you know, um, he's he know he's going to be back. You understand? I believe that they all will be back next season. The Bulls right now are ninth in the East, knowing DeMar DeRozan, he's going to try. Do you understand? But the Bulls is done. You know, they um, have never, they're not going to reach their full potential. And it's so crazy because because uh, Zach was involved in trade rumors. You know, one minute you heard L.A., Detroit, um, New York, Miami. I mean, the list goes on of all of the teams you heard with Zach. And then out of nowhere, this season ended surgery. This was a gut punch. This was a big time blow, you know, um, for the Bulls. And they continue to spiral completely out of control. But nonetheless, this is a great sign to see. 
uh, that Lonzo Ball is amongst his basketball team at the end of the day. I, I can't discredit that enough. I'm so excited that um, he was out there, you know, um, and he spoke, listen, it is what it is. He spoke also on some of the young guys on his team, you know, the Kobe Whites of the world and things of that nature. You know, he spoke on how um, good they, they, they are. You know, he knows the keys and, and things that they have to do. But what I will say, he lines on ball. If we discussing that knee, he is getting better and better every single week. And he's getting closer and closer. You know, so um, it, it is what it is. Billy Donovan said yesterday, ball is pain free, but hasn't started running and cutting. But I'm telling you, what's next is what I'm trying to tell you. They, they trying to check all of the boxes. And. This was no, this was you. This, everybody knew this was going to happen. You understand? Um, that Lonzo Ball was going to get, take this thing slow. He was not going to rush nothing. You understand? I'm telling you, every knee will bow when Lonzo gets back, ladies and gentlemen. Everybody's going to have to pay homage to this man. You understand? And what he brings to the table on that basketball floor. You understand now, I believe it's going to be with Chicago because the Bulls are stuck in between a rock and a hard place. If they was going to make if tr make trades, they would have did it already. You understand? They are they are committed to Zach. DeMar, they committed to these guys. They just paid Vooch. You understand? Um, they, they're not, they're, they committed to these dudes. So I'm expecting this team to roll around next year with Lonzo intact, you know, and for us to really get a fair shake at this thing. Uh, for them to restart the process on how it was, obviously, is a new NBA. The Bulls are have are loaded with talent, y'all. Whenever you could put a DeMar DeRozan on the floor, Zach Levine, a Vooch, you just need somebody to stir the pot, you understand? And there was no pot stir, you understand? Even though when Lonzo was there, they were so, so crazy. And, and it's so wild because Lonzo had him in a position where a lot of people was upset with Lonzo. Well, why you ain't asserting yourself? What well, Lonzo allowed them to be to be them, you understand? Where it sometimes it might have been best suited for Lonzo to take a step back for DeMar to be in the MVP race. Sometimes it had to, Lonzo had to take a step back for Zach to reach his full um utmost potential. You understand? And the list went on. Sometimes Lonzo had to sit in the corner for dudes to really open up the floor the way it needed to be. And you seen Lonzo taking the reins game in after game. He really got cheated, you understand? And it's very unfortunate to see how the Bulls was head and shoulders over everybody and for him to go out for the epic collapse and for them never to reach their promised land. We had AK was an executive of the year race too, y'all. You understand? It was about to be some uh, some awards running around Chi-Town. And now it's nothing but turmoil, dark clouds, injuries, and a whole lot of we don't know. Better days are coming. Listen, Lonzo Ball will return. Homage will be paid. It's Flight Sports TV. I'm telling you, man. This kid is the truth and a half, you know, um, just like Magic Johnson said, is, is no point guard in this league with a higher basketball IQ than Lonzo Ball. It's Flight Sports TV. You already know what